Hello, welcome back to Andy Knighter's Motorsport, Atomic Engineering, <laughs> idiot. And I just thought I'd bring you something. Messy hair again, I should really get a hat. Just thought I should bring you something of sort of some importance. Um, and it's something that probably a lot of people don't realize. And it's to do with these, these little bad boys. If you've got a trailer, you've probably seen them in the trailer shop, Halfords, camping places, you know. Um, yes, this is assembled backwards, as you can see, the little notches here and the solid bar here where the, the lock is. I don't have the key with me. This is a bit of a security thing. I haven't got the key with me. This arrived today. Um, all three keys are at home. It is the hex four-sided key, just to give you a little bit more security. You know, no one's gonna pick that. Well, a lot of people put these on trailers and the cheaper trailers, you know, your little box trailers, your three, four, five, 100 pound trailers, um, probably even up to your 900 pound trailers don't have lockable hitches. They're just like a, almost like a pressed steel thing with the, the handle. So people put these on to lock them. <laughs> yeah. Now, this is no trick like photography. I am filming this on my phone. Focus. Focus for you. I'm filming this on my phone using mate's trailer because it's in the workshop. Yeah, give you an idea on security. Keep the trailer in the workshop. I'm going to put this on his trailer properly. You're going to watch me do it. I'm going to prop you up. I've got my little witness here with me. You've seen the car before. Rara! <laughs> Rara! He's going to help me with this because I'm doing it on my phone. Haven't got my stand, uh, tripod, haven't got anything. But I was too excited. I ran out of the house with this because I had to show you how bad these are. Don't get me wrong, this is cheap. Come on. Chinese one. Don't know if you can see that very well. Does say made in China. It's awful. All of these are exactly the same. This one was £7.70, I think, from eBay. But, look, I'm going to try and do this one-handed. Nice nice shot of my mouth. Right. Hitch. This one's got a lock. Ignore that. This bit down here goes in this way, so you've got the big, big bit to the back. Uh, I'll prop you up. <laughs> this is where Ra Ra comes in because he's going to help me. So what I need to do is I need something like that. Not that you can see him, but he's sort of holding my phone up. Something like that. So this bit goes to the back of the trailer. Trying to do this carefully so I don't knock my phone over. Baba! There we go. Right. Can you see that? The lock is right here. Little pin in it. Just see the back part of where they assemble it all through. Now, this part goes in here and this part goes over here. So. That's down. That is, look, not lying to you. You can see the teeth, see the lock. Might even just be able to see down there somewhere. Maybe. I'm not very good at this filming stuff. Now that's on, that's secure. That is a lock. Watch this. Shell Drivers Club card. 
old one. Prop it back up. Something like that. Come on. Because I need two hands for this. That's disgusting, isn't it? How bad is that? I faffed with this for a little while. This is a bit of plastic card. This isn't a metal shim. This isn't shim, some shim steel. This is a plastic card you are gonna find in your wallet. And if you don't have one in your wallet, take a walk down to your closest fuel station Pick up their loyalty card. Go to a supermarket, pick up their loyalty card. This just happened to be the first one that I was throwing out of my wallet. Get some out of the way. It took me that, about 30 seconds worth of work, to put a slight bend on it. Just heated it up, bent it round. Bang, I was in. Now for the next bit. Hmm. In like sin, I messed about with it because it's plastic and it's obviously not the first time I've done it. Burnt the edges up a little bit. Just be able to see. Focus. Took me what, 15, 20 seconds? I time it maybe at some point. And I mean, and people are risking their trailers on that security. You know, that's no key. That's no picking the lock. You can put the world's most expensive lock in that. Uh, yeah. Engineer, not thief. <laughs> I'm not claiming to be a thief. I The second I picked it up, I noticed an engineering flaw in it. Hey, it happens. And I should let you know that if you've got one of these on your trailer or guarding something, obviously it's going to be a trailer, caravan, something like that, get rid of it. Within 15 seconds, less. Probably someone that sits there. If I make one of these out of shim steel, like, you know, a 0.5 shim, which is thinner than this, harden and temper it, and run it down the side, in. Get rid of them. They're not worth it. You are going to lose what you've worked for for someone who's got a bit of plastic and a tow ball on their vehicle. Friendly reminder. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you like the content, please subscribe. More is coming soon. I'm out for the next two days. Um, got hospital Thursday. Wednesday is preparation hospital stuff. I'll be back Friday, hopefully firing on all four. Hopefully I've not got any boost leaks. Um, there will be more coming with the race car, wind's blowing door shut. Um, the man van <laughs> trailer, you might not have seen. Can't remember in the last one. Um, you haven't seen. Yeah, trailer. Um, look, keep it real, keep it safe. Get shot of it. Get something that's, you know, properly secure. And from both me and Rara. Ra, ra. Peace. See you all later.